Welcome to this course and I'm going to be talking about how to start your own review blogs. Starting your own review blogs uh, can be a great way and, and a fun way to earn an income online. So here are the following topics I'm going to be covering in the next few videos. I'm going to show you which niches you should be in or the most profitable niches that you should be in when starting these review blogs. I'm also going to talk about setting up your site where to find the products to review, how to write a review, and I'm also going to be sharing with you free traffic methods that you could be using to drive immediate traffic to your review sites. And lastly, I'm going to provide you more tips on how to grow your business. When looking for a niche for your review sites, you want to find a niche that has a lot of hungry buyers and a lot of affiliate products that you can write reviews on. Okay, probably the top niche out there right now is the health niche. This is a sixty billion dollar niche. I've even heard that it's a six hundred billion dollar niche. And you could even focus on sub niches of that. For example, you could focus just focus on the weight loss niche. You could focus on health for seniors. Uh, you could focus on pain management. Uh, the yoga niche, juicing, etc., etc. There are dozens and dozens of sub niches under the health niche. Another niche uh, that is full of hungry buyers is the make money niche. Whether it's people looking to make money online, uh, marketers and biz or businesses that are looking for tools, software products to help them generate more income online, and just basically any other course out there. It, it could even be how to trade stocks, or make money with options, etc, etc. Okay, another uh, niche that is very lucrative is the financial niche. Okay, whether it's getting out of debt, insurance, or whatever. Uh, another niche is the relationship niche. Uh, people that are looking to meet people, uh, dating niche, um, how to get your ex back, and so on. So what there are products for even how to get your ex back that you can promote as an affiliate and write reviews on and another very lucrative niche is the self-help niche where people are looking to better themselves and improve certain areas of their lives once you're ready to set up your review site go to namecheap.com to register a domain name now your domain name could include the word reviews in it so that people know that it's a review site. For example, it could be softwareproductsreviews.com if that domain is not already taken. Or it could be datingguidereviews.com. Okay, and once you get a domain name registered, uh, you're going you're going to want to host that website. So go to hostgator.com. That's what I currently use. And uh, now, if you cannot afford it, uh, you could try to go for free hosting by going to zero 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 webhost.com. Okay, and once you have your site up, you can install WordPress using Hostgator's one-click install okay um, now if you're not using Hostgator or if they don't have a one-click install uh, you could also go on YouTube and watch some video tutorials that teach you how to install WordPress and WordPress is a very powerful tool that allows you to easily create beautiful and professional looking sites okay so once you have WordPress installed you're gonna want to shop around for a WordPress theme to basically structure your site and have it and give it a more professional look. For a free theme, a popular one is called Responsive. At uh, this URL right here, WordPress.org slash themes slash responsive. Okay, and this is what it looks like right here. Just click on preview. If you're passionate about the niche that you're in, writing reviews shouldn't be that difficult. But let's just go over some tips in this, this video. 
Okay, now if you don't feel comfortable writing, another option for you is to shoot a video of yourself giving a review. Now, actually, I think that is much faster than writing something down. Okay, uh, another thing you could do is to outsource the writing, and of course, that's going to cost you a little bit of money. Okay, so now when you're writing a review or you're you're shooting a video, uh, make sure to first provide a quick description of the product. Okay, uh, explain why you like the product and give any other positive reviews from other people who have bought it. And you may also want to include a couple of negative reviews just so that you don't seem biased and that you're just trying to promote that product. But what you could also try to do is to turn that negative point into something positive. So for example, if you're reviewing a weight loss or a, tra a weight loss training program, uh, you can say that the training or the tips are too hard to follow. Um, and then, but then you could turn around and say, but that is why it'll work only if you are committed to it. Okay. Um, another thing you want to do is, you know, once you write your review, at the very end, you know, try to summarize what you wrote and then include a call to action. For example, click here to check it out. Or if you're offering bonuses, say click here to see my bonuses, or you could even write about uh, your bonuses, but make sure to include a call to action and you could also include a call to action throughout the review so you could put a button click here now button in the middle of the review now I'm just gonna quickly talk about a couple of free traffic methods in this video and this, these traffic methods can bring you immediate traffic to your review sites okay so with the first method we're gonna utilize uh, a tool called Google Alerts. So you would just do a search for Google Alerts here on Google. And I'm sure most people are already familiar with Google Alerts. And what it does is uh, you would type in a keyword here and you would get notified by email whenever that keyword shows up on a new article or a blog post. So for this example, let's say you are doing, you've written some reviews on Vitamix, which is a high quality blender that is in the price range between 500 to over a thousand dollars. So you can get some pretty good commissions promoting the Vitamix. Now, so you would type in that keyword here and then type in your email here. Okay, and try to try to sign up for as many alerts as you can. So instead of just using the product name, you could also uh, do the competitor product names. For example, the Nutribullet, uh, Breville, and other names. Uh, you could also do alerts for keywords in that niche. For example, the weight loss niche, or juicing, or or blender, or fitness for example, okay? You could also do alerts for well-known health experts in that niche, okay? So you wanna do as many as you can, and hopefully um, when you get alerted, you will be one of the first to comment on those sites, because if you're one of the first, uh, most likely your comments will will get a lot more exposure. And Now, when you type in your comments, you cannot just say, wow, that was a great article, now check out my review of this product by going to this link. Um, you're going to have to provide some helpful comments, so you're going to have to put some thought into it. Um, what you could do if you want, you could, you know, write a helpful comment, put a lot of thought into it, and then what you could do is just use that comment multiple times, just copy it into other sites that you visit. Okay, now another traffic method I want to talk about here is visiting forums. So you just do a search on Google for forums in your niche. So if you're in the weight loss niche, you would just go weight loss forums. Okay, and basically visit these forums and again you're going to want to provide a lot of helpful tips or comments and what you're going to want to do is put a signature in your posts 
a signature that promotes your review site. So for example, you can your signature can say something like, for my review on what the best Vitamix models are, click here.